what is going on friends? We are at beautiful Virginia National Raceway and I am behind the wheel of an all new Mustang. <laughs> The Long Beach. <laughs> what is going on, friends? Today is testing day 2023. We got the whole squad here, Adam, Chelsea, James. First time we've all been together. Really unique test day for us because it's we are absolutely not nearly as prepared as we usually are. We've been so busy building three new cars. A majority of the team is still at the shop now building James's car. Uh, as many of you know, Adam and I will be sharing this car. Uh, when I drive it, I have my livery. When Adam drives it, I'll have his livery. Of course, this is Chelsea's car. And um, yeah, it's going to be an uh, interesting test. We're all going to throw in, throw down to get it done. Uh, these are one of those moments that, you know, you got to go back to the roots and everybody's got to be involved. You know, normally, it's evolved to where the drivers focus on driving and the team runs the cars, but things are a little bit split up and different today. So, but we got a badass group, good vibes, and we're going to get it done. So uh, I'm about to go get the tuning done uh, in my car. Uh, first dial in NA, then we'll hit the nitrous hit. So uh, and then we're going to start dialing in suspension on Chelsea's car, get that in the box. Then we'll put that in mine and Adam's car and get to work. So, uh, you know, we made some changes this year. Um, our new uh, rear suspension, making some, uh, getting it a bit more linear and just a little bit more controllable for what we're doing out there. We got new shocks from BC, so we're testing all of that. Um, some new power things. There's a lot of new, new that we're getting in the box today so that when we get to Long Beach, we know exactly what knobs to turn, what things to adjust to have the best cars we can. So yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Uh, again, a different kind of change of process, but we'll get it done. We're, we're passionate and we're in it to get it done. So uh, yeah, let's get to it, friends. You're allowed to see it. I really like the fender. This thing right here. Front wheel inside of it. Yeah, the new headlights too, and like this thing's cool. Yeah, that's the RTR grill vents. Our grill, our new, our new grill. Our chin splitter that I just knocked off 30 seconds ago like an idiot. I went in the first turn and completely just straight understeered straight off the track. <laughs> It is. It is like lower. That. Yeah, it is a bit lower. These are pretty neat. Thank you. What's it made yeah, well, of? we we changed. It's made of. Um, I had a tool made, so it's vacuum form plastic. You know, because we made the suspension changes the car, the wheels had to be flat. And I personally don't love flat wheels, so I, we that's why I put the air disc on there. Just another new cool look, and also something very different we've never done before. You know, the dash looks crazy. That's super cool. Is it gonna stay looking like that? Yeah. So we actually started doing carbon on our own. This is one of the first pieces. That's why it's a little bit rough. So I think eventually we'll put a new one in there, but I like the chop strand look. It looks pretty cool. No, I, I like it a lot. I feel like this would be cool in one of your off-road cars. Right, like, yeah, yeah. Kind of with like the rough look of it. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'm excited for you to feel it. I think you're gonna be stoked. RTR spoiler. So everything you're seeing, so this will basically be what you can buy. You'll be able to buy this spec five for the street. And then, so that's our rocker splitters, spoiler. And then the chin, the grill, those are all parts that'll be on the RTRs. Hey, serious question. 
before you drive, should we take all the bumpers and stuff? Out? I was just thinking about that. <laughs> I literally Only thought about it. Only because of what we said in the car. Dude, I, uh, I, I thought about it on the way here, and then I do that. All right, look at that. We got a guest today. Yeah. Hey. About to ride with the boss man. I love how you're just taking every little thing that you can in, bro. Yeah, that's what it's all about, and uh, spending time with the team and with you guys and learning as much as I can. Oh, yeah. So, this is almost going to be like my car from the, the right hand side. From that side? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, let's feel it from this side. still working through all of that. We're setting the suspension up right now, the droop and, and bump and spring. We're trying out some different things. We've upgraded the car with a few things this year. Overall, just getting some laps, making sure the car is good, the tune is good, on and off the nitrous, and then also trying to dial in some of the uh, things we thought could be improved from last year. Pretty much great setup, but we always keep finding little ways to evolve it to be better and make better odds of me being able to win and enjoy driving the car. So, uh, so we're testing something new on Chelsea's car. We tested, you know, the um, the other cars have, uh, we've always run eight stacks. So eight individual throttle bodies, you know, eight individual butterflies directly to the intake. Uh, intake ports. Man, you should be going to MIT or something. So now we've gone with a more traditional uh, intake manifold um, with a more traditional, you know, throttle body. It effectively looks like a carburetor, but it's fuel injected. And um, the, the theory is that we'll get a little bit better drivability and we'll get a little bit better nitrous distribution, allowing us to get more power. And um, we're also testing some new cams on Chelsea's car with the mindset of getting a little bit more power up top and not compromising mid and bottom. So he's testing that. Chelsea's got really good feel and he's super analytical. Um, and obviously being so in touch with the cars last year, uh, that's why we decided to put on his car first, test it, and then if it makes sense, then we'd transition uh, to the other cars. sitting around all day now it's time new Mustang. I even set it with the Fox body display. I'm gonna go out and uh, feel it out. 
Uh, my first time feeling it on a racetrack uh, outside of the Ford Proving Ground. So I'm excited to feel the drift brake and uh, just play around. I uh, can't give complete details, no driving impressions, but I am gonna show you guys some fun. And uh, that's what it's about. Let's get it. Damn impressive. That's all I can say. They made this thing super easy to drift and extremely fun more soon. <laughs> well, that is gonna be a wrap on a wild day of testing. Uh, some things went as planned, others didn't. We got some challenges to work through in a short time, um, but we'll get there. I'm confident in the team really love how the new cars are performing how they look uh, how they feel from behind the wheel and uh, i could not be more excited about the fun that's going to ensue around our team and these new ford mustangs this year so uh stay tuned friends as always appreciate the love and we will see you all soon whoa <laughs> there it goes to long beach you go to long beach <laughs> off he goes <laughs>